Good morning and welcome to Vlogtober Day One. Hi. <laughs> Hi. doing vlogtober I decided I wanted to challenge myself and vlog or at least post a video every single day of this month I'm a little nervous I'm not sure what's gonna happen but definitely subscribe hi, and hi. see what happens I'm not gonna lie it, vlogtober did not kickstart the way I had envisioned or planned I was gonna wake up have my coffee get myself together but I woke up at like 8 this morning from the sound of Cam saying mommy from the door and I just jumped out of bed. I didn't even know what was happening. We have a play date at 9.30. It was all sorts of chaos this morning, <laughs> trying to shower, get myself together, put on makeup, um, give Kim a little bit of a snack before we met up for breakfast with our friends. Mom life for you. You can't really plan these things sometimes. <laughs> I think I'm just really exhausted too because I've been having insomnia lately and I think my body just had enough of it so I slept in this morning which I guess is better to get some sleep um, but yeah at the same time I was just it was so hectic this morning so but we made it uh, we're actually a little bit late but we're gonna have breakfast with our friends and then just continue on with our play date so let's do this Hi guys, so I just put Cam down for her nap and I think I mentioned in a recent vlog that her nap time and bedtime routine has been awful. It has been so difficult, I feel like I can't get her to bed without her whining, putting up a fight, going into my room, constantly asking for mommy's room and I'm not gonna lie, these nap times are like crucial for my sanity. Just getting her into her room like just heightens my anxiety and I can't handle it anymore. <laughs> I feel like it's been weeks of doing this and honestly, it has to stop. I feel like today was the first time where I was like, I'm done, I'm done with this. So I, instead of just kind of going with the flow, letting her calm down, I was like, we are going into your room I don't care what you do, you can read, you can play, you can do whatever you want in your room, but I am not going to be here. I'm leaving this room and you're going to be in here for at least an hour to two hours, ideally, but I've had enough. Um, I don't know if she understood me, I just know I feel good about doing that because I'm tired. Like I'm tired of just... I just know my limit and if I don't have this time to myself, like my breaking point is very near. <laughs> so I don't hear anything from her now. Usually she's like wailing and crying for like a good 15, 20 minutes. I don't hear anything, so that's good. Um, and I'm hoping to do the same for bedtime because bedtime has been a struggle, you guys. <sighs> so anyway giving you guys this quick nap time, bedtime routine update. If you guys struggle to put your kids to bed, let me know down below. What have you done to fix the solution? Obviously, I don't know what the heck I'm doing sometimes, but I feel good about this. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, I'm gonna go finish some laundry, tidy up the kitchen, and then just kind of relax for a little bit, so.
good job. It's definitely dinner time. But we can have lunch. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hi guys, so Cam's up from her nap. She didn't really sleep, but that's okay. She was playing the whole time, just reading books to herself. So that is exactly what I want. Um, the hubby should be home soon. It's around five right now, but I did go ahead and make dinner. Um, just in case, I just did a pasta with bacon, ricotta, and peas. And it's actually pretty tasty. Added some lemon, lots of garlic, olive oil, all that good stuff, so. <sighs> Okay, so just waiting for the hubby to get home, which daddy is home. You excited? Let's go see him. So, yeah, he doesn't usually like to go out to eat when he gets home on Fridays. You ready? No. No? <laughs> okay, so Kim's down for bed. Much better today. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. We maxed it out at 30 minutes to put her to bed, even with her meltdown, but then we left the room. And it hasn't even been 10 minutes and she's already asleep. Yeah, that's good. Yay! So we're gonna keep doing this. No more hour long bedtime routines. What do you think? <laughs> I like that idea. Okay, yay! It was a good day overall. Obviously, I'm gonna relax with the hubby. So I hope you guys enjoyed this first day of Vlogtober. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Bye. <laughs> Thanks, Sue. That was good. Thank you.